Uh, Wayne, thanks for your time. We appreciate it. So first, can you tell us when this happened and where exactly in Johannesburg? Yeah, Johan, uh, we have no information on it. Uh, all we have is as it is currently on social media. So we, we don't know where, we don't know what time, we don't know why. So really, it, it, it's for us really to uh, investigate it uh, for now. We, and there's no formal complaint. So at this point, it is just a fight between uh, a law enforcement officer and a civilian. So has this officer not come forward with this information that he was attacked? Not at all. We don't know uh, which officer it is. It's in the video, it's very difficult to identify the officer. And we have no information other than what is seen on the short clip, which is now on social media. And you are investigating it, of course, right? Trying to find out yes. who it is. Yes, there is an investigation. Uh, Wayne, this raises questions about whether people actually take Metro Police officers seriously. We do know that when you try to raid, uh, you know, vendors a couple of months ago, they attacked the officers. Again, recently, we saw more visuals of uh, people attacking Metro Police officers in the city. It speaks volumes about whether or not you are effective when it comes to fighting crime. You see, uh, law enforcement... Uh, is a very difficult uh, function and role because if you're enforcing the law and you see right now we don't know what uh, happened uh, if the officer was trying to restrain uh, the, the person to place the person under arrest or why did the fight take place R really we have nothing at this point to say about the video other than that the incident is being investigated. I'm not talking about the video, Wayne. I'm talking about the ability of your officers to actually conduct an arrest, which you seem to be struggling with for a couple of incidences now. Yes. No. Uh, look, uh, if you're going to be arresting someone, I'm, I'm talking about in the shoes of an officer. If you're arresting someone who doesn't want to be arrested, then uh, there's going to be a fight. And it seems that your officers are losing this fight. No. Not if you look at the stats, uh, the successes of the uh, volumes of people oh. whom we are arresting uh, every month. Uh, over uh, 4,000 people were arrested in one, ta in one month. Uh, it's, it's not a loss. We are not losing. Yeah, this yeah, but you, you must be worried because these videos are always emerging of people overpowering your officers. This one right now, another one two weeks ago, and then I think it was a month or two ago, we saw your officers running away from street vendors. Yes, no, um, I mean, in the video, what we're seeing is a serious fight. And why it's happening, we don't know. Uh, that will have to be investigated. Okay, thank you so much for that. Appreciate it. Wayne Mina is the JMPD spokesperson.